my point about LeBron is that like historically, deep, deep, what he's right doing now. right now at 38 yeah. is unprecedented, man. The guys what, what? have multiple 40-plus point games. And granted, it's going to take off some steam because they're not winning, because he doesn't have AD available in the fit with Russ doesn't really work, and there's questions around that. But him individually, man, is prolific. Like, what, it, what, the game uh, of basketball has never seen a, a specimen like him. Jay, what 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 time? What what? How old was um, MJ when he really retired? Not, not the like hanging on, the chilling Wizards? out. Are you no, talking about like the second three peat at the end of the second three peat? Yeah, because I don't the, the wizard game. I, I mean, I understand he went to all. He still put up buckets. No, in no, no. Man. I, I know I understand, but that was that was different. Though that was like that was like when Magic played forward. No, no, not exactly. Nah, keep, 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 oh man, come on, I ain't gonna let you do that, to MJ. I played against that dude. Look, but it didn't look the same as what I'm saying. Well, not athletically, it, it but didn't. all the moves were the same. People still couldn't stop it. I get but it, Jay. I know. Good key, you're remembering the last year. He came back with the Wizards, played two years with the Wizards. First year he got back there, he was great. He was one of the uh -huh. best players in the league. He wasn't himself, but he was one of the best players in the league. Then he got hurt that year. All, all and then I when he came about. back from <laughs> hold on, when he came back from that. The next year, that's what you're thinking about. That's Max what it was like. Come on, man. This week. Well, I, mentioned no, 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 no. I told you. No, that's, that's not what I'm saying. Right? <laughs> what I'm asking you is I don't – the Wizards was cool. Yeah. But let's not fool each other. Right. It's not the same. I'm talking about when he retired after it was all done in Chicago. 2003. How old? Was he? How old? Uh, you know, the age, that's why I was asking the age. Not year. Five, maybe? Yeah, I don't, know, I don't know the exact age, but I know it was 2003. Like, so he was 34 years old when he retired from the Bulls. Yeah, and so there's that, and then. So who knows, 90, man? If hey, Jay, 98. Who knows if he the LeBron's 38? If he had continued to play through. If he'd have continued to play through, who knows? I, yeah, but some guys are built for longevity different than others. Like Jordan retired after the first three Pete, retired after the second three Pete. You know, like. It, it, and you just look at him physically. He's not no, nah, but 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 Max, but, when you push through, and you know this is what you want to do, like LeBron, you train a certain way, you do certain things as professional athletes. You don't chill out. MJ chilling. He's smoking cigars. He retired a little bit, trying to figure out what he's gonna do with his portfolio for a minute. He gets bored. Maybe uh, I'm gonna do some tequila over here. Maybe I'm gonna do, and then he comes back and plays. It's different than pushing straight through. No, you, you know, right. it's like You're Tom Brady. That. If Tom Brady retires, yeah. it comes back three years later. What you think he's gonna look like? Yeah, but, but it is like when you when you I know you've seen it up close in person, Key, like when you're next to Braun, mm -hmm. but like when you're standing next to the cat and you're like, yo, you 6'9, 250. Yeah. Big like, difference. by the way, that's the size of Carl Malone. Yeah. To put into perspective for people. When you used to see Carl Malone back in the day sitting next to MJ. Who was known as like the Stein. biggest dude in the league who that's wasn't a That's a guard. Yeah. That's Braun as a yeah, guard. Right. So you see that dude as a freight train still piping it on cats in traffic like he did against the Grizzlies. It's a different type of athleticism. Carl Malone had his T-shirt tucked in some jeans, man. <laughs> Miss me. <laughs> it's a little different. <laughs> Look, Jay. Miss you me, said man. I ain't talking about Malone. Like, you got it. You go ahead. You go ahead and have your Shannon Sharp with Carl Malone. I ain't going. My man, I ain't doing that. He had his I ain't, ain't messing with that dude, man. He's different. <laughs> looks like into his jeans. Look, looks he like had the Wranglers on too, Key. And with the big old belt buckle. <laughs> oh God. Looks like LeBron's gonna pass Kareem in the next what? Two he weeks. Yeah, two hundred points. Yeah, two hundred points, something like that. Lakers, meantime, 22 and 26. They're in 13th place in the West. They had a chance to pick up a game on a team that's two games ahead, but six spots in the in the playoff rankings, and now the Lakers fall another game. All right. Um, according to Dave McMenamin, I mentioned Anthony Davis before. He's going to return tonight against the Spurs, barring any setbacks. Is he returning tonight? Mm -hmm. The Lakers have gone 11 and 10 since AD went down. That's actually good news for them, I think. If you can keep your... Your head, you could tread water, keep your head just above 500, and then you get your second best player back, you know, or basically 1A. That's good news for the Lakers. Are we done believing uh, Ben Simmons will be a star in this league? Can I, can I address something before we get into Actually. whether Ben Simmons will be a star or not? No, no. I, I, I really, and I, I know it's easy, like as a, as a fan, you could sit there and say he's stealing money. I, I get it. He's underperforming, drastically underperforming. You know, but like when you refer to a dude by saying he's stealing money, ski mask and all, we're comparing him to bank robbers now? Like, that, that's... Well, wait, are you being a little sensitive about that? Yeah, right I am now, being sensitive, because that's coming from an athlete. That's coming from an athlete that I know 
has been in a position before, if you want me to keep it a buck, that Jay Rose underperformed too now to a degree. Well, some of his okay, contracts. So okay, I'm just okay. being real about it. Like yeah. it's okay. like I just get frustrated when there's not sensitivity levels when it's coming from our own. But I wonder if like, you if talk it's coming, to Jalen. Hold on, Max. If it's coming from you, yeah. or if it's coming from Stephen A. Smith, uh-huh, you I feel get it. Yeah, yeah. I understand. But when it's coming from one of our own, like when they haven't performed at an ultimate high level and they've gotten rewarded deals here and there, we've seen it. I mean, we get Jalen on the show to talk about I this. Jalen's to. my dude. But so 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 I'll bet you, my, my guess is this. If you ask Jalen, hey, you ever steal money? He'd be like, yeah, I stole money. Here's when, right? In other words... There are some people who are sensitive to that, and there are other people who might say, I, I apply that to other people because I would apply it to myself too, and I believe that Jalen Rose fits into that category. In other words, it, whether or not he would ever say he uh-huh. did steal money, he's a type of dude where, yeah, man, I could tell the truth about myself so I could tell the truth about other people. You See, know I mean? I'm, I'm, I'm more with Jay on this one. The choice of words, that, that matters, I think, to, to both myself and Jay. He is underperforming. He's not playing at the level. You 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 talked about is he ever going to be that guy in the NBA? That's a different conversation. But you know, stealing money to do work hard, whether whether he's performing at a all time high or not, he's working hard. But guys, he's in off the room. Mike he's, key, I'll hear you guys all <clears throat> like we you know when a dude gets paid a certain contract, whatever, and then a certain attitude prevails. You got you know people to, you know real talk. They'll be like, come on, man, dude's stealing money. And no, of course. Yeah. But, 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 but Max, even stealing money, okay, steal ski mask and all, like that's a, it's just a different, it's a different level. I, I I hear how you're trying to rationalize it. I'm just gonna tell you how that is reflective sometimes when you hear that in the locker room because Ben Simmons is still one hell of a defensive player. Yeah. He may not be able to score the bucket at all. He needs to be more aggressive. So they panning for they, they, so like, so essentially they panning for defense. Well, the Nets uh, have a plus. Four and a half point net efficiency with him on the court, two and a half, two point four with him off the court. So he, when he's on the court, they are. Well, we although on ESPN, let although me steal some money. It, it is, it is like you know who else is he on the court with? But just by that metric, they're two points better with him on the court than off the court. Chris Canty, look who is who is coming to join us right now. I, yeah. I, I you got say, a problem with that? Can, no, can I just explain no. it to you real quick? Yeah, yeah, I want Jay because because I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna tie it into <laughs> sometimes how I feel like in this in this past like. Five, six years, some of the things I've heard, people, shut up, play basketball, things of this sort, right? Yeah. When I hear us describe players, right, mm-hmm. like as black men, players, it's like, oh, he's stealing money, ski mask and all. I'm like, yo, man, like you're starting to really enter a different conversation in my – Yeah, want you to take there, it to a personal realm when it, you start talking about somebody's so, money. Thank you. Like so, that's a faux pas in any professional thank locker you, man. room. Don't talk about my money. And that doesn't just stay while you're mm-hmm. an active player. Even when you're a retired player, you don't talk about somebody else's money. Now, so you can he, say maybe the team is not getting the return on an investment, but when you start talking about a guy stealing money, knowing how you hard that, it Max? is to get to see that how, point, it's personal, man. It's hey, out of Max, pocket. I do Max, see that. Coming hear, from us I do see that, but, but, but you hear what he said, the return on the investment? I know, but that's the, also... that's the choice of words that I would have preferred to see my friend Jalen Rose use. A fellow athlete, Key. A, opposed to stealing money. Ski man, oh, no, we don't need bank robber. We don't need to. I just use have heard players. Ref- I have heard players talk about use that kind of language. On, no, no, on TV, people say, "Man, he's stealing money." Like, I, it's not like we've never ski heard ski mask athletes. and all. Does, what? How does that change stuff for you? He's he's just kind of coloring it in a little bit, right? That's one hell of a just, color, man. What, well, just think about some of the connotations and stereotypes that we have for people in our community, Max. Like, that's just not exactly the. You don't use the, terminology the phrasing like or or, okay. or the no, terminology not at all. that you want to go I'm not with go that. with. You know what I mean? I, I'm interested <laughs> to hear. I'm interested in hearing uh, Jalen's point of view on this. Actually. I would love to hear other athletes' POVs on this one because it, it just hit Max. It hits differently. Like mm-hmm. underperforming. Hey, he's not living up to expectations. Like I rather the you could even I you hate bust. I rather you say bust. I rather than ski mask and all just takes clearly it to a set you off. Yeah, yeah it does. Does. he, he could have simply said, "What does he have? Pictures of him or something?" I mean, he could have said that. You know, a lot of other ways to be descriptive and add color to it than say yeah. ski mask and all, brother. I'm, I'm, I'm interested real in deep. hearing what Jalen has to say about that. Well, that, that said, though, Ben Simmons. All right, we're going to turn this water on this one. Nobody's refueling that. That, that, that being said, said, Ben Simmons needs to step up. Dude, Why can't he? Stealing now? money. Oh, no. Is that okay if I say Come it? On, it's not even no, it's not okay rim. if you say that. I didn't play in the league. It doesn't matter that you can listen, rap. You can't say it. Listen, listen. <laughs> he, it's funny because you think you go back a couple years, 
when Ingram was second pick. Yeah. And the gap between them, you were like, damn, could you imagine the fall off? Ben Simmons is a superstar. He's going to be this. He's going to be that. And now look at it. Yeah. Right? Like, what it did. What happened to this team since that Atlanta game? Man. Any time, anytime you say Atlanta. Brandon Ingram, that's a sore spot because I'm a Lakers fan. Wish we could have that one back. <laughs> wish we could have that one got back. A chip, got a chip out of it. <laughs> got a chip oh, out you of can't, it. You can't wish you had that back because we don't know if it would have been the same. You Chipped can't. Up. Right, we man. don't know if uh, all these young dudes yeah. we moved on from, Kyle Kuz and all them, if they'd have been in L.A., they may have still been performing at the level they I'm, was performing listen, in L.A. Key, I hear you, man. The summer, champ, the summer camp championship was cool, but, I mean, Brandon Ingram with LeBron. At least I know with Brandon Ingram, for the most part, he's going to be out there. Well, Brandon Ingram doesn't become Brandon Ingram if he's still with LeBron James. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Uh, you know what ball. I mean? That's what I I'm hear saying. Rock, I, hear, I hear you. I hear you. You, know, man, you, you can't know complain about a chip. This, this, is, chip this, is the, this is the fan in me talking. No, I hear you. LeBron gave you all 40 plus last night. Yeah, I mean, listen, the, the, pro boss. the promise of Anthony Davis wasn't just what one championship. Do for us, Jay? It was a <laughs> championship window. <laughs> yeah. And it doesn't seem like they're ever going to realize that potential with that. They're team. 11 and 10 without him, and now he's getting back tonight. Like, let's see. Let's see what it looks like. What about three and a half games separated. Did, did you see what it looked like last night? Yeah. <laughs> well, they didn't have he him. Dro he, dro he dropped 46. LeBron dropped 46 points, and they got boat raced by the Clippers. But maybe with AD, it's a little different. I'm saying he's going to get back tonight. Let's see. And by the way, he might not hit the ground running. You got Twitter going in the storm today. Why? What happened? People saying that we're we're sensitive athletes and mm. downers. And, you know, downers? We're defending Mike McCarthy and uh, what, are, what are we are we defending Ben Simmons and mm -hmm. I'm like wow. So uh, an alternate. No, we're not defending. We're just trying to that we can give a different view and perspective on the way we see things. It's exactly. not. We're not defending him. He's not playing good basketball. That's just the bottom line. He's not playing what they thought when they drafted him. Let's well, just put it that the way. The Ben when Simmons thing is wild because he, yes, he was hurt also, but he's a guy who was playing at a certain level very quickly, right? Now, we expected him to get better and better from that, but he hasn't even approached that level again, but he's at an age where you would think that would be possible. Guys, think of how many things he did as well as just about anyone who ever lived, maybe better, at his size. His mm -hmm. handles, his court vision, his passing, his defense, his He can still do all of that. Defense. He just right. can't score. That, that's, what, that's what's so <laughs> perplexing is how do you go from that to this? It's just so I think people are you know, trying to get their heads around. It, it's pretty apparent to me, though. Like, even when you hear him talk, I was watching TNT. This is like probably seven or eight nights ago. And, you know, Shaq and Charles Barkley and these guys are talking about a key. And, you know, Kenny Smith was trying to talk about you know, one game he had 13 assists and nine rebounds. And, how he was doing things on the defensive end, the passing and the rebounding, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. uh, and then Shaq and Charles, they had points too about like, well, you got to at least look at the rim. There feels to be <laughs> some block to me yeah. for Ben Simmons offensively. And I, what, what I, if he, I don't know Jay, what but that what is. But what if he just says, what if he just says, I, that's all I want to do is I want to yeah. do exactly what I'm doing. I don't want to look at the rim. I just want to play defense. I want to. Steal the ball, want to rebound, and I, at times I want to facilitate. That's all I want to do. That, that's I, at certain point, it's like the yips. It's like yes. you know Chuck Knobloch for the Yankees suddenly couldn't throw to first base. He was a good second baseman. Suddenly but he just couldn't throw. But Ben Simmons never could no, shoot. But yeah, but, but he, he used to be aggressive in his way he yeah. would attack. And all of a sudden, the Atlanta series with the 76ers, he got the yips in real time, and it happened on the national scene, and he hasn't been able to get when over When you see something like Ben Simmons with the shooting key, or that's why I'm likening it to Chuck it, Knobloch, is there is something wrong. There is some yes. psychological yes. issue, right? It's not just physical, and I think that's why people are very kind of interested. I don't in know subject. if it's psychological. Maybe he just doesn't want to do it. Yeah, but Kia has to be because, frankly, every offseason, every offseason, what do we see? We see, like, from somebody who pays attention to social media, you see all the Ben Simmons highlights. Him shooting that thing, like, well, damn, he's shooting it, working out with his yeah. trainer, shooting the lights out, pickup games, shooting fadeaways. Yeah, but when that's, the lights turn on and you're in front of 30,000 people, what that's what I'm saying. I'm good. That's what we're saying. I'm good. I don't right, want to do it. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN Plus right now.